So this Halloween, forget carving, let's get to painting pumpkins for an ultimate and colorful DIY experience. Hallmark artist Tuesday Schmidt is here to actually show us how it's done. So I'm looking at all of these beautiful pumpkins. The boo over there might be my favorite. You know, do you have to be really creative to, to get to paint Okay, these? now to be fair, these are done by professional Hallmark artists, but we come up with a range of different pumpkins so that people, the, our consumers can look and at Think Make Share and find a range of things that they can do. Or, you, you, I mean, we have some that are just basic patterns. This Easy. is avant-garde. We could we yeah. could all do this. You got, you got this. You know? Okay. And I'm noticing a little bit of tape, a little yeah. line so, of tape. So, so what's the trick? Just kind of making them pop. What I've done, if you see this one, it's got the line. Mm -hmm. All we did was we took masking tape. And of course, I'm not going to be able to get it off on TV. <laughs> I painted it. You got it. So you take this off. Boom. You've got that like half and half. And then you can add doodles or just color the stem and you're done. You mix it with a range of other things. So I mean, for Halloween, that would be perfect if you wanted to make a pokey ball or something like yeah. this. And of course, over here, we kind of had that sugar skull look. Yeah. Well, this is we're having a Halloween party this year. And so the kids have a lot of different, you know, a lot of friends at school that are coming. And some of them celebrate Day of the Dead and some of them celebrate Halloween. So I think it's fun to have. I know that pumpkins aren't necessarily Day of the Dead. Right. icons, but but kind of mixing the, the different cultures and traditions. Okay, for... and you've painted this, but we're actually going to use markers on this, and she yeah. promised me that this one yeah. is easy enough that I can Well, you it. drew everything yeah. on here already, yeah. so you're ready to go. <laughs> wink, wink. Okay, so, okay, so you yeah, actually I'm, used a pencil I'm, for this? Yeah, well, this is paint. Mm -hmm. This is well, regular craft store paint, easy. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, I just penciled it in for you. You did it, wink, wink. Okay. Um, and then I did mine too. And all I'm gonna do, I'm so lazy that I'm not even gonna like mess with paint really. It's just paint markers. Okay. You so can also use Sharpies. So it, like, as you see this one, I just prepped it. I just painted the mm -hmm. black of Dracula, easy. So we're gonna get a little Dracula face on there. Dracula on here. Okay. So with these, and with the pencil, the great thing is you could erase it and then, yep. you know, add the more permanent color later. And I'm sensing these are like funkins. Could you do this on real pumpkins as okay. well? This one's a real pumpkin. The thing is, we, like our house right now is a crazy mess with Halloween stuff from Halloween party treat de table yeah. to costumes for all the kids. So um, I usually buy fake. And the great thing about these is you buy them and if you do them this year and they're good enough, you throw them in the basement and next year you bring them out again. See, that's so perfect because you do love the where you can reuse the decor, especially if you get it to maybe match a room or something like that. Yeah. And do you have any other really cool decorating tips? Because I see we got a lot of paint here. Um, you know, we love the tape idea, but anything else that if we're trying to do this DIY piece at home that we could use? It's the paint markers and paint basically is it. And like I showed you, just the mix pattern. So what I always do is a basic icon, like the winky eyes, pretty easy. And then it's some, some solids, like the purple one over there. And then you'll have the mm -hmm. mixed patterns and they all go together really well. And for these, like we're getting ready to do a Halloween party for the kids at our house. Wow. And we mix our style, you know, like we have ranging from four to 14 year olds at the party. So we want scary but we also want fun pops of color. I'm gonna mix these throughout the table with like skeleton skulls and all the stuff that are kind of scary, creepy hands. And it makes a fun, optimistic, bright pop. So that, that is great, especially for the kids, yeah. yeah. Um, would you say there are other ways that Hallmark is helping to celebrate Halloween? Oh yeah, so like I said with our party, for instance, the older girls wanted to do their own invites, but the younger girls, I just went and bought Hallmark invites, sent them out to their friends. Then Hallmark does treat bags, so we're doing treat bags for, as takeaways for all the kids that come to the party. Um, and I'm lucky because we have a gift, we have a Hallmark store right downstairs, so my Halloween's super easy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, and then I see all this orange paint over here. You know, was that actually meant for this pumpkin? What would you kind of do with the orange uh, paint? So there? this is the this one that I have open mm -hmm. as the red. Oh, it's red. My this eyes is, not is, good this today. This is Dracula. So oh. just a pop of color, and then like his blood right there. Oh, see, it looks so much better when you do it. You're even painting upside yeah. down like a pro. Well, that is why they pay me the big bucks. <laughs> and are some of these cards over here? Uh, did you happen to design any of these? Um, I don't. I, I don't believe I did any of these. Okay. I haven't done a Halloween card for a while. I just I'm the pumpkin lady at Hallmark. You're the pumpkin lady. Okay. <laughs> we well, do pumpkin workshops, and so I, we're always, you know, our artists are painting pumpkins and. Tuesday, so here I would just kind of like outline this, outline that, have that some teeth, in. nose, and we'd be done. Yeah. Good and go, to go check out Think Make Share. We always have a lot of templates and fun things for for busy moms. Okay, well let's take a look. He's only partially done. Yeah, we're gonna keep working. We're gonna finish up later. Yeah. Thank you so much, Tuesday. Thanks. We appreciate it.